Being a music artist is far from straightforward. I speak to a lot of singer-songwriters who aren't just singers and songwriters. They're booking agents, they're content creators, they're social media marketing managers, they're business owners. Ultimately, you are the entrepreneur. The music, the brand and the business are your responsibility. It's great to look for partnerships with agents, managers, labels, publishers, but you need to be in the driving seat. You need to be delegating by empowering people, outlining your aims, goals and objectives, not by being absent and hoping that they'll come good for you. I've seen so many people fail because they just thought, oh, the manager will do it or the label will do it. You have to take charge. You have to understand how the puzzle pieces connect and interconnect. If you fail to plan, you plan to fail. The vast majority of music artists will not succeed in their mission. If all you have is a plan in your head, some ideas or a passion in your heart, but you don't have the habits, you don't have the systems in place, if you don't have a plan that you can present to other people, it's very unlikely to work. People presume your ship will sink, so you have to show them it's going to float. When you reach out to people in the industry, you want to have a presentation that shows them the destination that you're heading to. So they want a ticket for that ride. I've never bought a ticket for a boat when I don't know where it's heading. So make sure you're really clear on this. Through the jigsaw, we're going to help you to get your act together. This literally will change the course of your future. So how do we help people to slot the puzzle pieces together? We start by looking at your mission, aims, goals, and objectives. We look at personal goals. We look at creative goals. We look at altruistic goals. We look at recognition goals as well as financial goals. What does it mean to be successful to you? And we start with the end in mind, thinking about the legacy that you'd like to leave. We then think about your offering and we break it down into a five level offering. We think about content, products, services, experiences, and subscriptions. If all you're doing is giving away content for free, it sounds like you have an expensive hobby, not a sustainable business. We then look at the audience. We think about how to attract a crowd, how to establish a community, how to solidify a core. And then we think about these different audience segments and we work out what channels will connect with these people, what channels will bring people in, what channels will add value to those supporters, to those fans. What resources do you need in the office, on the road, in the studio? Who are the partners that you'd like on your team? Now, you can try and do everything yourself, but you will run out of time and money and other people have experience. They have networks. They have platforms. You need to leverage that support. You need to know what categories should be represented on your team, what companies should fill those roles. What individuals need to be working with you? We then look at income streams. We look at cost structures as well. Now, before I go any further, I want to say, you know, maybe no one's ever shown you how to do any of this. I've been really fortunate. I've had some great mentors, including my dad. He used to have a team of dozens and dozens of accountants. So I've been really fortunate. He's helped me with my business and I love passing this experience on to other people. We look at activities because so many artists don't know where to start. They don't know how to prioritize. They don't know how to organize their time effectively. We look at the creative hat, what needs doing with the admin hat on, what needs doing with your marketing hat on. We think about the daily, weekly, monthly, quarterly, and annual habits. If you can take your ideas out of your head and your passions out of your heart and turn them into habits, you can make this work. It's so important though, that you get your act together and you slot these puzzle pieces together. You need a presentation of your brand so it's clear to you and clear to everyone else who might come along for the adventure. Anyone can produce an EPK, but serious acts create business plans. So once we've worked through the jigsaw with you, we'll help you to put together a business plan. Just like I'm showing you the jigsaw through this presentation, we create a presentation of your brand that has you in it, your branding. It's, it's completely personal to you. We think about what slides to include, might be 20, 30 different slides. Then we can present the plan for you, just like I'm doing now. We do it on your behalf. We create a video and a landing page, and then we can point people to it, people in the music industry. We can make introductions to people. You can also send it to people you know and new connections that you make. This will show people you mean business. Sending people an email with a link to your Spotify doesn't show that you're gonna have a sustainable business. The music industry is actually a bit more like Dragon's Den and Shark Tank than it is 
you know, American Idol and X Factor. You're much more likely to succeed if you have your head in this game. This will mean you're not going around in circles. You can clarify your goals. You can move a lot further and faster. You will save so much time and money by getting your plan nailed. And then you can turn what's in your head, what's in your heart into habits to make your dreams a reality. So when it comes to the brand presentation, we might do a page on your songs, outlining which of the winning songs people should have a listen to. We would describe the sound, maybe photos of you with your producer working in the studio to give people an idea of where you're going creatively. We outline your fashion and your branding and you know the, the voice and the message you're putting across. We maybe have photos and videos of your show to give people a taster of what you do live. We then outline the story because anyone working in the industry will want to know your story, how they can get human beings connected with you really quick through a story. And then we outline the system, show people that you have things in place to manage your time, team and tasks. And then we outline the strategy. So we can create so many different slides. Here are a few examples that we might do. We could do a social media growth chart to show what channels you're using and what your projections are, where you are, where you're hoping to be. We could do a page um, on several different typical fans and we break the fans down by name, age, gender, location, occupation. We think about how they first discovered you, um, where they primarily connect with you and reasons why they like you. So people understand you've segmented your audience. This is what marketeers do in record companies. If, if you show people you're doing this already, they'll be like, wow, this artist is going places. And then we could break down the team that you're looking to build and outline what positions are open, what positions are filled. You need to show people that you're going to attract a team of A players. It's so important you get your act together. The Jigsaw is an incredible program. Make sure you take a look deeper. Make sure you learn everything you can about how to create a business plan yourself. And if you need help to do this, that's what we do here. A resound media. The jigsaw is incredible. You won't find this anywhere else. So here's the quiz for you. Which artist is most likely to succeed in achieving their goals? A, the artist who has a plan in their heart, or B, the artist who has a brand presentation to share with potential partners? Hmm. The answer, of course, is B. So make sure you get your act together. We have so much we can help you with at resound media, the driving seat, the marketing map, Storm 5 Management, Third Floor Productions, Rocket Fuel. And the really cool thing with the Jigsaw is we can look at all of these areas as we go through the nine puzzle pieces. We have a really solid and comprehensive approach, and we'd love to help you move further and faster with your music.